Alfonso in the Philippines writes, Hey Paul, currently I am using an audio research Ref1 preamp connected to a Class A 2300 powering B&W 802 Nautilus. Yikes, it's, you know the Nautilus is that that snail looking speaker from B&W. Very expensive stuff here, bud. Good for you. <laughs> the preamp is starting to show various issues in less than a year. Hmm. Unpredictable volume, shut off when changing the volume level, one channel with lower output. Uh, that doesn't sound good. I'm considering changing this, but would like to do so economically. Okay. What would you suggest to look for in less expensive range? Mostly listening to rock music, but sometimes classical and pop. Well, shameless plug, I'm going to tell you to go for one of ours. <laughs> you know, a BHK preamplifier or whatever it is we have uh, is going to give that old audio research Ref1 preamp a run for its money, and it'll work. But um, what else? You know, to be honest, I'm probably not the best person to ask because I'm pretty much a fan of PS Audio products. That's why, that's why, that's why I do this. Uh, I'm also a fan of audio research. So if you really like the sound of the audio research, you might consider just getting it repaired or replaced. They're still in business. I mean, they got bought out by the guy that makes those um, stone speakers. I don't remember the name of the company that bought them, but I think they're still around. So you might just, instead of after a year, just dumping the thing, get it fixed. I mean, you got you got a lot put into that system. So you would try that. So I don't know what else to recommend. Preamplifiers are tough. There aren't that many great preamps out there which is kind of surprising. If you, if you look at all the technology that we have today, think, think about how difficult it is, technologically speaking, to build a state-of-the-art D-Day converter. I mean, there's a lot of technology in that. A preamplifier is quite a bit simpler. We started out building preamplifiers 50 years ago and have been building and learning. Now, there's a lot of intricacies to making one sound great, which is why I strongly recommend ours, but they are simple compared to modern technology. So you'd think there'd be a lot of great ones out there, and in the past there were, but today, not so many. So best I got. Good luck. Thanks. Thank you.